Amani channel here with VideoChefs.com. We are talking about iMovie today. And we'll get into a little tutorial on how you can create graphics um, in your videos. Because graphics are a way to uh, add a nice little professional touch. Alright, so uh, this is iMovie. It's a free software that comes with every Mac. If you have a Mac, I'm sure you're well aware of it. And if you're also thinking about video production, I would suggest you consider getting a Mac. Yeah, it's a little bit more expensive, but um they make video just a little bit more easy um to do all right just the, the workflow is nice and uh, they're stable um nice machines to use and i've edited with both pc and mac i started off uh, with a pc using windows movie maker and uh, got into adobe premiere and now i'm on a mac using final cut and iMovie primarily all right this is your event library so this is where uh, all your uh past projects uh will be archived and you can view um, so, you know, and anything you've done, you can always refer back to um, in the event library. All right. And this is the clip um, that is the clips that are in your library, um, the particular events. All right. And this is the player. So once you have your video that's been selected or imported that you're going to be editing with, it will appear in this window here. And then this down here is the timeline um, where you can add effects, music, narration, all of the above. So if you want to import from your camera, um, you'd have to have a camera connected via FireWire, but that's how you would do it. Um, or from your eyesight camera, as in this case, because my eyesight camera is turned on. All right, but I don't want to see. Look, look, I'm just looking like a hot mess right now, right? So let's uh, just go to done. You don't want to really see me. All right, this little button will allow you to sort of switch the layout. So it's just more cosmetic. Some people may prefer to um, watch their raw footage here and edit in their timeline up here, all right? But I like to do it this way. This button will allow you to make things bigger or smaller in terms of your timeline and your clips. And you have some options here if you want to record some narration. This is how you do it. You click on there, have your microphone plugged in. Um, you can crop and do some photo effects and video effects using this button. And then this is where you add your music from your iTunes library, um, your photos from your iPhoto library. You can add your text and graphics here, transitions here. And then it has some simple motion um, effects as well that you can add to your videos here. All right, just some uh, curtains and some, some maps, that sort of thing. All right. So this is the clip we're going to be editing with this little interview that I did with my son, Devin. He's almost two and a half and this is his first ever interview. Um, so we'll look at the raw footage to start off with. It's like a 45 minute interview. It's really short. You know, kids have short attention spans anyway. So now stay still. Okay. Stay still now. Sit down on, now sit here, daddy's lap. What's your name? Daddy. And how old are you? T. And who are you holding? What's in your hand? Bear. You like the bear? The bear. Yeah? You like your daddy? Daddy. What's your daddy's name? Mommy. And what's your mommy's name? Daddy. Very good. And then Devin runs off, all right? So I want to edit a small little clip from that interview, all right? So with iMovie, you just click on the clip, all right? You can see this little yellow area highlights. All right, and so then what you do is you would drag the left portion of it to the beginning of the clip you want to edit, and the right portion you just drag to the end, all right? You kind of have to eyeball it with iMovie. Um, like in other editing software, you like put it in and out point. What's your name? Dada. And how old are you? T. And who are you holding? What's in your hand? Yeah. All right. And that's pretty much the end. All right. Let's play one more time. What's your name? Dada. And how old are you? T. And who are you holding? What's in your hand? 
beer. You like the beer? Right. And then you click on it, the little hand will appear, and then you just drag it down into your timeline. And there we see it there. All right. So now the first thing we'll do is we'll create a little title slate for uh, the video. So we'll go to centered. And there are a few options with I, iMovie. You can sort of go through the different ones. You can um, let's see what pull focus looks like. All right, you choose your background, and then you can edit your text. So we'll go. Devin's interview. What's your All right. And there it is. You see it kind of comes into focus there and then it blurs out. Then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add a little lower third title. So you have a couple couple of options here. You can see you can do these cool little clouds that pop up. Um, let's see here. There's just a general lower third you can do. There's one that's kind of to the left, to the right of the frame. Um, we're going to do one of these right here. We're going to do the... Uh, soft bar black all right and you can see here you can either play it on the whole part of the clip you can lay the the graphic on the whole part or just a, a certain quadrant we're just going to lay it on the first portion of it all right so it says title text here say Devin. Alexander. Put a little subtitle here, so I'm gonna be a little well I'm gonna be a proud father and call him a cute kid. Alright, so let's take a look at it. What's your name? And how old are you? Two. And who are you holding? What's in your hand? Beer. Alright, that's all we want to do. And then we'll just add a couple of little transitions because it's always uh, good to do this next thing that I'm going to do. Going to add a fade to black at the end. Alright. And let's add a fade to white. Right in the middle here. All right, and you have a you have a bunch of different transitions, but my my thought on transitions, and some of them can make your videos look a little cheesy. Um, so you know, a dissolve might be good. Um, you know, you, a cross zoom might be a good one to use. Um, fade to white, fade to black. Uh, some of these curls can add cheese and, and, you know, just sort of experiment with them. But, you know, if you think you're being cute or, you know, you can overdo it with effects very easily. So just be judicious in how you use your effects. All right. But let's look at this video now. What's your name? Devin. And how old are you? Two. And who are you holding? What's in your hand? Beer. And that is it. And then if you want to export it, uh, a couple of things you can do here. You can just uh, export it directly to YouTube, to Facebook, Vimeo. I mean, I, I, iMovie is great. Um, or else you can just export the movie. Um, and it'll give you a couple options here. All right. I just export using QuickTime. So you can just export it full resolution. And... Uh, there you go. All right, so just a quick tutorial to help you get started with iMovie using the graphics. 
Um, show you some other tricks at another time. Just wanted to get you started on my channel. Got a question? Ask at webvideochefs.com. Leave a comment. Talk to us. Let us know how we can help. Thanks a lot.